welcome you from historic Fenway Park as we get set for this ALCS. The Houston Astros, the defending World Series champion, the Boston Red Sox, 108 wins, marquee matchup on the mound with Chris Sale and Justin Verlander. Second inning, he's got him loaded now. Runners go and a swing and a shot, and it's in the left field, goes under the glove of Nunez. Two nothing Houston. Brandon Workman is on to pitch. Swung on and drilled deep to right center. Jackie back over toward the triangle. He looks up, it is gone. A home run over the Red Sox bullpen. 4-2 Houston, the first long ball of the series. Two on with one away. He's on the first pitch, down the right field line, down by the pesky pole, and it is gone! Yuli Gurriel, three-run home run knockout punch. Game one win for the Houston Astros. Good evening, everybody. Welcome to Fenway Park for game two of the American League Championship Series. Lou, David Price has just taken the mound. The Red Sox need to split this series heading to Houston. Going to Houston down 0-2 is going to be tough. The big question, how does David Price bounce back from his performance against the Yankees, and can he do well against the team here in Houston in this game tonight? He kicks and delivers. Playing and a miss and a high fastball. Down he goes. Here's Mookie Betts. It was four for 20 in this postseason, one for four last night. He is one of the most dynamic hitters in baseball. He's a, a ticking time bomb to do to do some kind of damage. And that one's ripped, whoa, way back, center field. Springer looks up, and it's off the wall. Betts is flying around the bases, and he will stop at second. Scoring chance right away for Boston, and a swing and a liner into right field. A base hit in the score is Betts. And the Red Sox have the lead. one nothing in the first inning. He swings it, ground one in the left field, the base hit. Here comes Ben Benintendi, Bogarts is held in third. It's 2 nothing Red Sox. We go to the second inning. And he muscles one fair just inside the line. This is going to score two. Springer is on his way to second with a two RBI double. Just like that, the Astros have tied it up. David Price back on the mound. We go to the third inning now at Fenway Park. Price is in one here, runner at first. He takes off and a swing and a high fly ball deep left. This one's going to fly out of Fenway. A booming home run for Marwin Gonzalez. It's a two-run blast, and the Astros lead 4-2. Bottom of the third inning. Jackie Bradley Jr. now from Boston. In the air, left field. That is slicing down in the corner, and it is off the wall. Two runs are in, and Devers is going to score. It's a three-run double. Jackie Bradley Jr., Boston on top. Bottom of the seventh inning. Here is Xander Bogarts, and that's going to skip away. Here comes Betts, and no throw. Betts is in. 6-4 Boston. We head to the bottom of the eighth, and a line shot right center. It's down. Devers will score. Leon to third, in the second with an RBI double is Mookie Betts. Here we go with Craig Kimbrell. It is a safe situation. And that's high in the air to left field. Benintendi with his back against the wall makes the catch. The ball game is over. And Boston wipes the brow and hangs on to win game two. Tied 1-1. One, one, and we're going to just keep continue to take it one game at a time. We know that this place is going to be loud and nuts. And, um, you know, I think that just kind of, you know, helps us, um, you know, get up and get ready for the game. And, and uh, I think we're excited and we're confident in the guys that we have. And, you know, I think these, these past two games have kind of showed that, you know, it should be a back and forth type series. From the Space City, Houston, Texas, it's game three between the Red Sox and the Astros, all even at one win apiece. Mookie Betts ready to lead off for Boston. And Mookie swings, drills it up the middle, a base hit. And that's how game three begins with a single up the middle for Mookie Betts. A 1-1. Swung on, ground ball, third base side. That's a base hit. And so back-to-back -back base hits off of Keuchel. And the Red Sox have set up shop first and second. And nobody out for J.D. Martinez. 
Keuchel kicks and comes home, and J.D. hits it down the first baseline. That's a fair ball. Loki Betts is going to come home, and with nobody out, the Red Sox have a run on the board. And here comes Xander Bogarts from the pitch. And Bogarts hits a ground ball to short. This will get a run home as Benintendi scores. 2-0 Red Sox. Well, the first inning, Nathan Ivaldi's taken the mound 1-0 in the postseason so far. And here we go with George Springer to face Nathan Ivaldi. 2-2. Swing and a miss. He got him to chase. And there is strikeout number one for Nathan Evaldi. It's two down. Altuve at first. 2-2. Two, two. Swung on and a bouncer to third. Devers misses it with a backhand attempt. It goes down to the left field corner. Altuve will touch third. He will come home and tie the ball game. Rounding second is Bregman. It's a 2-2 game here in Houston. Dallas Keuchel out of the ball game as we go to the sixth inning. It's a 2-2 game now. And now the sidewinder, Joe Smith, is in. 1-0 to Pierce. And Pierce drills one deep to left field down the line. If it stays fair, it's gone. It is fair. It is gone. And the Red Sox lead it 3-2 on a solo home run by Steve Pierce. Who absolutely crushed that pitch into the Crawford boxes and right down the left field line. And the Red Sox get the lead right back. And the Astros bring on their closer down a run, Roberto Osuna. Well, here's Jackie trying to break it open here. Devers at third, Holt at second, Moreland at first, and the 1 1 to JBJ. Swing a high drive to right field. Reddick going back, back to the warning track. This ball is going, and it is gone. A grand slam for Jackie Bradley Jr. And the Red Sox have broken it open. They lead it 8 to 2. Jackie with a three run double in game two, and a grand slam in game three. That is unbelievable. The biggest swing of Jackie Bradley Jr.'s career. We go to the bottom of the night. Eduardo Rodriguez takes the hill to get the final three outs of this one. The Astros down to their final strike. Kick in the pitch. Swung on and miss. Strike three. And the Red Sox take a two games to one lead in the American League Championship Series. Rick Porcello prepares to take the hill to start game four. They do a really nice job of... Um, putting pressure on you and then they have a lot of guys that have power that can run into pitches that you leave in the middle of the zone especially with runners on base so be aware of that and um, you know do the best you can to avoid those mistakes uh, especially with runners on. And in the first inning it was the Red Sox with runners on base. That's it third and JD at second two down. Devers in the air left center field it is down a base hit. Betts is in the score. Martinez will score. And the Red Sox strike first again. Rafael Devers with a two RBI single. And it's 2 nothing Boston right out of the gates. And Bogarts rips it past third. A fair ball. Benintendi scores. Bogarts around first. He's on his way to second. Red Sox lead it 3-1. to one. Reddick lines it into left center field. That's a base hit. Altuve is going to get waved home, and he will score and tie the ball game. Kemp hits one down the right field line and deep. To the corner it goes, and it is gone. A home run just inside the foul pole. And the Astros lead it 4-3. to three. Xander swings, grounds it hard, and it's in the center field, a base hit. Here comes Benny rounding third. Springer with a throw to the plate, and he slides in safely. We're tied at four. And there's a ground ball through, base hit. Guriel is coming home, throw from Benintendi, not in time. Astros are back on top, and a high drive, way back. Back it goes, and this ball is long gone. Jackie Bradley Jr. sends it out of here, and Boston is back on top. He swings and lobs it into center field, a base hit. Mookie turns third. He will score. It's a two-out RBI base hit for J.D. Martinez, and the Red Sox lead it 8-5. to five. Three on, two out, ninth inning, 8-6 Red Sox. And a great player at the plate in Alex Bregman. Swing it a line drive left field. Ben and Teddy coming on. Dive. And he makes the catch. Oh, what a play. He got it. The Red Sox. Well, I just went head over heels in my chair. That was a <laughs> the Red Sox win on a spectacular catch by Ben and Teddy in left field. What a game.
What a finish. Boston Red Sox will clinch with a win tonight. They lead the series three games to one. The one two is deep in the left field and J.D. Martinez with a home run. Boston strikes first as Martinez pops his second home run of this postseason his first of the LCS Red Sox won nothing the two ball two strike pitch from David Price to Marwin Gonzalez on the way right now as David kicks and delivers swing and a miss he got him chasing one of the dirt that is strike three and Price with his seventh strikeout, he strikes out three in the inning. One nothing, Red Sox are on top. We go to the sixth inning. Their at bats are are really exceptional. They have tremendous balance. They put pressure on you from the very beginning. They don't concede any at bats. They do it right, and and that's why it's hard to get 27 outs against them. And Marlin in the air to left field. Back on it is Kemp, and at the wall he leaps and. And that falls out of his glove. That might have hit the wall first anyway. So in the second base is Mitch Moreland with a double. There's a leadoff to Bagger, and here's Kinsler looking for his first hit of this series. And the 2-2, two -two, and he shoots one to right field, a base hit. Moreland will be held around third. Devers has looked very comfortable against Verlander. So now in the air, left field. That is hit well. Got some carry to it. That's going to fly. And this one is gone. Rafael Devers, a three run blast. It is 4 0 Boston. Price giving the Astros all they can handle in what is his biggest start as a member of the Red Sox. Perhaps the biggest start of his entire career tonight. A signature start, certainly. Can David Price keep it going here? This is a huge story developing and a swing and a miss. It's his ninth strikeout for David Price. That is a new career postseason high. Six shutout innings. You know, when you see the emotion of the, the, the last pitch that he threw to Altuve and he punches him out, it mattered so much to him and he stepped up in a huge fashion. That's championship caliber performance. As we head to the bottom of the seventh inning and now the Red Sox will get into their bullpen. Barnes will face Correa, Guriel, and Gonzalez. Fly ball, left field hit hard. Benatendi's back, got a chance. This one's going to fly. Marwin Gonzalez with a home run. Minute Maid Park in Houston coming down to the end here. We go to the bottom of the eight. The Astros are coming up. Nathan Evaldi returns. Got the final out of the seventh. In the air, center field. A line shot right at Jackie Bradley Jr. Bad break for Altuve. Nathan Evaldi gets four big outs. Nathan Evaldi's stuff just electric. Astros coming up. Red Sox three outs away from a trip to the World Series and here comes Kimbrell and we are headed toward the finish line close out opportunity for Boston Craig Kimbrell is on the pitch he's got Correa Guriel and Gonzalez coming up right arm bent at the elbow looks in gets the sign comes to the set next 0 2 swing and a miss he got him on a fastball up and away he came back with heat at 99, one down, ninth inning. Kimbrell has thrown 10 pitches, six strikes. He's ready. The pitch. Great, great call. Took a fastball right down the middle. One ball, one strike, two out. Runner at first. Bottom of the ninth, 4-1 Red Sox. Kimbrell at the belt. He fires. Swing a fly ball, left field. Benintendi moving back, back toward the wall. He reaches up, he makes the catch. And the Red Sox have won the American League pennant for the 14th time in their history. Andrew Benintendi with the last put out there mobbing Craig Kimbrell, who got the save tonight. David Price with a win, and the Red Sox are going on to the World Series for the first time since 2013. They beat the Houston Astros in game five, four to one, as the Red Sox are celebrating their pennant clinching victory here in Houston, Texas tonight. Can you believe it?